So is this going to be the hotel or not? Looks too good, huh? I don't know. This is my room. You can put some stuff here. Looks like a, an old board journal. Fish. Is this a piranha? I don't know. He have some towels and an extra blanket. I suppose I'm gonna put my stuff in there. Here's a mirror. Small sink. You just need to pump water from here. <laughs> so beautiful. Heating. In case I'm gonna be cold alone <laughs> tonight. Okay, here's my stuff. I'm gonna clean it. Some more light. And here's the bed. So you can have your privacy. Some nautical knots. A lot of knots there. Another window, books, das Meer, the sea, and that's my bed, <laughs> looks so cool, I mean obviously the room is pretty small, but what do you expect, it's a small room on a ship, on Vesa river. This is so exciting, really. I love this. And uh, yeah, this is the way out. This is how you leave the room. And I'm outside. some tables and chairs you can stay here and relax drink a beer talk to your friends or have a romantic evening there oh. I was expecting to be quite something you know when I booked it but it's uh, way above my expectations really Basically, this is the way out or the way in. When you come in, you see this uh, bigger vessel. And you just go there. <laughs> I'm so excited, like a kid on Christmas Day. Look, so pretty. And this is the way to my room. That's 
quite an entrance, you have to admit that. And here we are. Inside of my lovely room. Let's not waste energy here. What do you reckon? Would you live in a place like this? At least for a couple of days? I'm gonna show you some more stuff inside. That was a great choice, really. As you can see, I'm speechless. I should be talking more. Oh, look, there's a cat. Don't get scared. Hi, cat. Oh. Yes. Oh, you're so friendly. You're so friendly. This place gets better and better. Wow. The cat is exploring. I guess we could make an entire episode of the cat walking around. You are, you are.
I have a good feeling about this trip. Go and make a story inside. So here you have a kitchen with some free breakfast if you want to and a fridge. Put your stuff inside. Some more books. This is the common room. You can sit here and talk to your friends. <laughs> Free food. And some other rooms. More normal rooms. <laughs> Not like mine. Here's the shower. Here's the toilet. It's pretty small, but well, what do you expect? It's a ship after all. And here we have another you have another small fridge with some drinks. You can take whatever you want, to friendly prices, and you just put the money in there, in this barrel. Really cool. This is the way out. <laughs> here have a tea coffee muesli and stuff looks good huh Let's go to the city center, this direction. I'm rather hungry, so maybe I can get something to eat, some pizza hot or whatever. Well, I know these uh, international chains are extremely popular. 
and yeah, of course, you should always try some local food when you go somewhere new. But uh, I don't know how it's in your country. Check this. I don't know how it's in your country, but we don't have Pizza Hut in Austria, not at all. So, wow. I don't know if you can see this. Wow. Okay. That's not gonna be cool in the morning. Closes. I just okay. So now I can only answer with the key. So beautiful. <laughs> Getting back to the topic. I'm hungry, and uh, there's no pizza hot in Austria, but I love it. Uh, I have really nice memories with me as a kid going there with my family and the food is quite good I don't know I suppose it still tastes the same like Pizza Hut saying goodbye for now to my new home a nice little bench here that you can use to admire my new home <laughs> Yeah. Okay, let's go to the city center. Check what's open, what's not. Take some photographs and uh, film a little bit. What should the next video be about? <clears throat> you saw my uh, hotel review. Well, I suppose most of you liked it. Not my review. But the hotel, the Botel, actually, it's really beautiful. I was expecting to be cool when I checked uh, the Bremen accommodation on booking.com. I saw some interesting places and I thought, okay, either of those would, would be good, actually, for me. And then I saw this. It looks rather far from the center on the map, but actually it's not. It's really well positioned. So yeah, I had some second thoughts. Mm, should I book this one or not? But then I saw the good rating. I liked it, the fact that it's a boat. So it's something more original. To be honest, I also thought about uh, the videos I'm making. What would be more interesting to review a normal three, four star hotel or a random hostel somewhere or this boat? <laughs> so yeah, I thought to myself the latter sounds the best from the above mentioned options. So here I am, really happy with my choice, really happy. All right, comment if you want to, <laughs> or don't, whatever. <laughs> Tell me whether you liked it or not. for now we go and eat and film a little bit later it's getting a bit windy wait <clears throat> Bremen hat everywhere 
you can see it in the other videos so why not exactly in Bremen now I'm gonna look exactly like a local <laughs> exactly like a local like all the locals wear these hats and check this I'm so close to the Bex brewery I really hope we can make a tour taste some beer one of these dies and in case you forgot this coronavirus thing is a bit out of control so I don't know will this be open in the next days 11 years ago 2009 when I visited uh, Bremen of course I came to the Bex brewery as well as it was and still is one of my favorite beers and uh, I bought myself a really nice Bex beer t-shirt all green very beautiful and uh, I think one or two years later I gave it to a good friend of mine cheers mate if you watch it you know who you are <laughs> and uh, he he also loves beer uh, and Bex I mean <laughs> and um, I thought it's a it's a nice present it was a spontaneous present like he said he likes the t-shirt and I just took it off and, okay it's yours mate you can keep it but now I would like to have one for myself too if it's possible to buy one one of these dies we shall see I was also kind of hoping that uh, I'm gonna be able to go to the Werder Bremen shop or to to the museum you got it it's not a museum it's a museum <laughs> But uh, I'm not sure that's gonna be possible. Well, one can at least hope. We shall see if I am not allowed to attend the football game I paid for. I should at least be able to buy myself, I don't know, some Van der Bremen souvenirs. So this is the path I'll be taking every day to the center, back to the hotel. Can you imagine if you go back to the hotel and you're drunk and you have to enter that room of mine? Well, you saw it. It's not really something for drunk people. <laughs> It's not like I'm gonna be drunk, so don't worry about it. A German fisherman. A beautiful Beza. I'll give my camera a break. Yeah, when something interesting is going on. <laughs> 